begin navigation. Navigate. Start new route or Addis next stop. Addis next stop. Continue on I-10. Anybody parks in front of you? Yeah, I'm gonna put this over there and, and turn my truck. Yeah, I, if I were you, I'd take uh, that next space, like try to get into that, because that way, if somebody parks, they, if they can't get in there in front of you. Because if there's somebody else that parks is behind you, then you're gonna have trouble getting out. In three quarters of a mile, turn left before the Pi Y Asian Diner. Okay, in three quarters of a mile, we're going to make a left. I'm going to start moving over now. To the Planet Fitness. Now we're off to Costco to fill up on our way to Cracker Barrel for New Year's Eve. Darlene is getting really good. Awesome U-turn over there. I didn't get to see it because I was up front waiting for her. I was going to get out of the car to see if I could help her. But she did it with no problem, so she's getting really good. Man, it is getting super hot. This is the crazy thing about this weather here. Like, you're freezing cold at night, then in the morning you're like in a jacket, and then now, like I put this on, outside it's cold, but in the car it's hot. The sun is beating on my face, and just, it's crazy, man. This weather is like so crazy. A lot of traffic here in El Paso today. I guess a lot of people are going out for New Year's Eve, and it's getting crazy, so I'm glad to get out of this area. today to get gas everybody's got somewhere to go and it's gonna be a while but I'm not in a rush we're all filling up over here I'm filling mine Pam's filling up hers and then and then Darlene's over there she's gonna take up all of this room that over there yeah she's gonna need the whole space yeah so we'll just wait for her like over there we'll go over there and wait for her all right, pulling out of this Costco, man. This Costco is super crazy today. So much traffic. Arlene, she's over there getting her gas, and then she's got to go all the way around to come over here. All right, here we are. Arriving at Cracker Barrel Old Country Store. All right, we made it to the Cracker Barrel. Feels good. This is where we're going to spend the night. Muffin. Did you go want to go to the Cracker Barrel? But we're all parked right there and going into the Cracker Barrel. So the girls are waiting for me at the Cracker Barrel because I had to feed Missy. Missy's on her old time and she starts chewing my silicone spatulas. So I'm going to go inside. So they're going to meet me there. Not at the store, so I guess they've already been seated. I'm going to go look for them over there. Then I'm going to go look, look around. Apple cider vinegar, chicken breast. Barbecue chicken breast. Yes. Apple the wholesome. Cider. Barbecue chicken breast. Uh, I'm not allowed. Uh, that's a big steak. I had that once. It's pretty big. And yeah. she did three sides. And then mashed wow. potatoes. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> Alright, so Darlene is having the country fried steak, mashed potatoes with white gravy. 
Wait, what's that again? Turnip greens. Turnip greens and this one? Pinto beans. The pinto beans. And we're having super salads. Because our food is not ready yet, yep. And we got lots of cornbread and biscuits. biscuits. Yep. Apple cider okay. vinegar. Apple cider vinegar, the same I got. Mashed potatoes and corn. Yeah. And I got the, the same apple cider vinegar and the mashed potatoes. And my okra is not here. Looking at the sky, it looks awesome. You're afraid you're not going to get up? Is it too soft? Okay. Alright. Oh, yeah. Alright, so it wasn't cold. That's a nice view. Looks nice. time, but we pointed out that tomorrow isn't here right now, baby. An absent mind came to roam around. Captured you in a foggy cloud, baby. Standing on my toes on the edge, I'm ready to go. I see it clear when the shadows are lit, I'm ready to go. Overnighted here at the Cracker Barrel here in El Paso. We had a good evening, but I'm taking off. I am taking off. I'm so cold, man. It is like 32 degrees. What the heck am I doing here? I have a house in Florida. Ah. The reason I'm taking off is because I have to edit a video. Today is New Year's Day, and I have to edit a video, and there's Pam is still sleeping. Darlene still has some stuff she's doing. We're gonna try to travel to Las Cruces today, but I have to do my video. They're both retired, I'm not. I, I'm already so behind as it is, but I'm exhausted. I mean, it's, it, this is very tiring. I mean, I get up in the morning, I do all this stuff. The cold is another thing that really knocks you down because now you're also dealing with a lot of stuff and then you're also dealing with this extreme cold. Right across the street is this Walmart, which is awesome, but it's kind of sketchy if they allow it here or not. I think they would have been okay last night. We should have just come here, but it's fine. You see the trucker over there? He probably parked here last night. Nobody was going to do nothing last night. I mean, they know people drink on New Year's, and anywhere you're parked on New Year's, it's perfectly fine because they know that people drink, and they don't want to have a problem. So I'm going to head over here. I got to be near the rocks for a muffin. Because, man, they do not have grass here in El Paso. We're going to drive to Las Cruces today. So hopefully I'll be done by 11 so we can have the nice hot afternoon and drive to Las Cruces. I'm going to go in the camper, do my work, and wait for the girls to come over. I left the girls back there. My truck camper is right next to her trailer so you don't see it there. But I'm on my way to Walmart because I got to get water and I got to throw my trash. Trash is first. And I'm going to upload my video there. And then we can head out. So I, since I have to shop anyway, I think, well, I'm just going to try to upload there because today's a holiday. And I'm not really going to find the trash in there. I'm not going to have a lot of options today for upload because pretty much everything in the whole world is closed. Except for Cracker Barrel. They were going to open at 7. So they were going to be super busy today. And I said, I won't be there because they probably need the spots. So that's why we're here. Oh, the girls went to Home Depot to get the reflectors. I paid 16 in Florida for my roll at Lowe's. They said that there was 24 over here, but it might cost more on this side of the world. So I don't know, that's a couple of dollars more, but whatever. Or they might be just looking at different sizes. So I don't know, I didn't go with them. Look at the mountains, so beautiful. So beautiful, you don't take that for granted. This is at the Walmart here. They have the corn tortillas that you don't normally see that elsewhere. These are bolillos. Manager special was 33 cents, another 25 cents. I'm gonna get these bolillos and try them. What happened? I forgot, I've got my little sticker. I gotta put on my license tags because they were uh, they were up December 31st. But I have my That's sticker. That's like me. Go do it now. Yeah, Go wait for me. 
today is the 1st of January. Sticker alert, if all of you have big trucks, like I do, we have to register it, not on our birthday. If it's um, over half ton in Florida, we have to register on December 31st. And she just remembered she had to put her sticker because she saw me putting my sticker today. It's the first, so I said, we're gonna go to Border Patrol today. So I wanna make sure that my sticker's on there. And I also have my registration with me and gotta get this phone call. So we're gonna wait for her. She's looking for her registration. So make sure that when we get to Border Patrol, we are on point in new mexico they did put a sign up for us it says welcome to new mexico land of enchantment we are arriving at the inspection station also known as the border patrol my heart is racing i have my registration here and i have my driver's license here so we shall see what they say
not a lot, so I'm just going to keep slowing down for her. Um, she's white knuckling it over there. These truckers don't help too, especially when you have like several of them coming in during those times. I'm dealing with the gust too. 20 miles to go. Hopefully we will end this soon. Because it's a little bit stressful today. There's no way around on that side, so we're gonna go around this. Stay there, and I'll, I'll I'm gonna go check because I saw some RVs back there. I'm gonna go look. All right, I'll stay right here. Just I don't like taking the spot of a trucker. I don't want to be on mud. Super, super windy here. Um, we're gonna try to find something else because it's just gonna be super cold now. It's not even like down in the dirt. Afraid a trucker might hit me. We're all parked here. We all fit here in this trucker spot. So we're gonna try to find a better option. If that place had marked RV spots, they should. They have a lot of land there. They should have RV spots there. I didn't like that place. Like we, supposedly from the app, it says we have to park over by the gravel section back there in the back where those RVs were that you saw. I just don't want to be back there. I don't like it back there. I think it's too lonely, too dusty. The rest area is gonna be a better option. We're almost there. Hopefully this is it because if not, we might have to come back. 
back here, I think that's not a good spot for us. But I think that's going to be a better spot for tonight. Because other than that, we're going to have to drive another hour or something. And we're all tired, and the winds are gusty, gusty, and she's just about had enough with all the gusts out here. And so, and so did Pam. Pam felt a lot of gusts in her van. So everybody's tired. They just want to go in for the night. So that's what we're going to do. New Mexico allows you to be here 24 hours. Anything over 24 hours, you can be fined. Uh, she's parking here. And, um, there's a fifth wheel here. Who's gonna open my, the middle lane is for traffic, and then there's another space over there. And then she's parked over here. I'm parked over here. I'm good. I think this is better. Not as windy here either. And noisy. I mean, we got the road noise, but not as bad. But it's not as bad as the other spot. It's not as bad. It's a lot better here. I think we feel, we feel safer here tonight than over there. turkey black bean chili because I had the turkey there I had the black beans there and I really want a hot meal and I'm gonna put cheddar cheese on it when it's done so it's got four minutes left I'm running my generator I'm gonna give this girls a nice hot bowl of fresh chili tonight with fresh ingredients cilantro I got my cheese for the finishing touch on the top and some chopped up cilantro it's gonna be really super yummy and then I have some bolillos which are like some breads Mexican breads that I bought at the Walmart because they were on sale. I thought, oh, this is going to be interesting, so I'm going to cut those and give them some of that. And look at this. Wow, isn't that beautiful? That's stunning. Spam over here. Look at the view. Alright, there's people going to spend the night here. And look at this view. Isn't this magical? It's just beautiful, man. It's gorgeous, the sky here today. Just breathtaking so cold out there i can't believe how cold it is i'm just waiting for my food to get done i'm doing 10 minute pressure release and then i'm gonna have a nice hot bowl I'm gonna put the cheese in there and the cilantro and then i'm gonna have a nice hot bowl of chili with my bolillos forgot to show you my chili but it is so super delicious i'm having it with that bolillo uh, bread and um it tastes super good it's so great to have the instant pot i got tons left over so i'm gonna store it lean said that she was going to bed early she had already eaten something and pam i think is asleep because i texted her also to come over and get a hot bowl and i don't i she hasn't answered me so i think she's asleep so i'll just save some tomorrow they can have some for lunch i have some tortillas there you can have it inside some tortillas that would be nice for lunch time thanks for watching if you like this video don't forget to give it a thumbs up subscribe and hit the notification bell don't forget to leave your comments down below Oh, I'm so far in the sleep. I don't know, comfortable. What's this? Stickers! Get yours by going to the description box below.